and away from security matters. Nigeria's new electoral act is set to mandate political parties to conduct their primaries six months before the general elections. This was revealed by the chairman of the Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, Professor Mahmoud Yakubu, at a joint session of both INEC committees of the National Assembly in Abuja. The chairpersons of both committees of the Senate and the House of Representatives urged lawmakers and stakeholders to be open-minded to ensure that the amended electoral act resolves the current challenges during elections in order to ensure Nigeria's polls are free, fair, and credible. Without prejudice to the suggestion of this committee, the focus of this building is on the electoral flight of Nigerians and it draws inspiration from new views on public and electoral actors. As the process goes on, all agitations and suggestions, especially those connected to the public, are very dear to us and are being considered except, for instance, that are constitutional. You will agree with me that this is generally commendable. As we go into this session, I urge my sister to put in a series of committed efforts into evaluating each clause by clause and interrogating it where necessary in order to have the most electoral act. As we consider this important deal in this retreat, I ask us all to be open in our contributions and suggestions on how the electoral legal framework for election administration can be further improved in this country. I'm hopeful that this request will give us a clean copy of the bill for consideration and timely passage by the two chambers of the National Assembly. The Senate President has made a commitment to Nigerians during the public hearing that the bill will be passed by the National Assembly before the end of the first quarter of 2021. This act is a key foundation for it. Of course, it's necessary but not sufficient. Many other things have to happen. But it is really crucial, including for people who've been marginalized, women, young people, and people with disabilities. Their voice needs to be heard. We need to ensure INEC has the time, as I said, to plan properly for this election. So your work, it's, it's a bill, it's technical, you know, things have to be, commas have to be moved around, and all the text has to be right. But I think we need to raise our sights and recognize why this bill really matters. One of the provisions that actually excites me a lot is it helps the commission if there is certainty in the way we prepare for elections. And the uh, new section uh, 29, subsection 1, now commits political parties to conducting their primaries 180 days to the date appointed by the um, commission for election, meaning that parties will conduct their primaries and submit the names of their candidates to the commission at least six months to the next general election. This will enormously help us, such so that uh, by, say, two months of the election, probably all our materials will be in location. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.